Hi, I'm Donna and welcome to Pasta TV. In this episode, I'm going to be showing you how to cook pumpkin and spinach ravioli. I'm going to show you how to get the product and crack it because the product actually comes in sheets. So I'm going to show you how to crack the ravioli into individual ravioli, cook it and then do it in a light butter sauce. This method that I'm using will be exactly the same for the ricotta and spinach ravioli. My water is boiling and now I'm going to put, add some salt. So before I put the salt in, I'm going to put my wooden spoon in to stop the water from overflowing on the pot. I'm going to put some salt in, just give it a good stir. Make sure it comes back to the boil. And then I'm going to put the ravioli in. The ravioli will take about 15 to 20 minutes to cook, depending on um, how you like your pasta. I'm going to use the box to actually put the product into the water, but again I'm going to put my wooden spoon into the pot and I'm going to lightly toss the product in the water. Then I'm going to give it a stir, bring it back to the boil and put the timer on for 15 minutes. Occasionally throughout the cooking process, you're just going to give the ravioli a very gentle stir. I'm going to start to get ready the butter sauce. I've got about 150 grams of butter, which I'm going to place in a flat frying pan. And then I'm just going to slowly start to melt that. As soon as the ravioli is ready, I'm going to put them into the butter, toss them, add um, a few fresh herbs that I cut before, which is parsley and dill, and that'll give it a really fresh taste. We're going to add a little bit of that Parmesan cheese cracked pepper and we'll get it straight to the table. The other thing that I could actually do um, if I wanted something a little bit different is to um, toasted pine nuts. So I could toast some pine nuts and also throw that in to the mix because that'll go really well with the pumpkin ravioli. All right, my butter's melted, my ravioli ready. I'm going to put some fresh herbs into, into the butter and then I'm going to quickly mix that. So that'll infuse the flavours into the butter before I put the ravioli in. I haven't changed the heat under the frying pan. Now I'm going to pull the ravioli out bit by bit. Now you can either use, depending on what you prefer, a slotted spoon or a, um, a strainer. And it's the same strainer that I use to do the gnocchi. I don't want to tip the ravioli into the sink, into a strainer, because the, putting them into the sink is just a little bit too rough for them. So now all I'm going to do is actually toss them in the butter, parsley and dill sauce. I'm going to add a little bit of parmesan cheese on top. A bit of cracked pepper. And there's your ravioli ready to go to the table. Thanks so much for joining me on this episode of Pasta TV. I hope you enjoyed it.